The Syrian opposition has lost more ground in the northern province of Aleppo. Minnich military airbase, however, was not recaptured by government troops and their allies. It was taken by the Kurdish armed group, the YPG, and its Arab allies. Syria's opposition says the YPG has been taking advantage of the Damascus government's offensive to expand areas under its control in Aleppo. The YPG militia from the start of the revolution has been working for its own interests. It created an autonomous area. It never recognized the Syrian revolution, but it used it to create its own state. The capture of Minnich Air Base means the YPG is now close to the main rebel-held border crossing with Turkey. This has increased concern in Turkey, which considers the group and its political wing, the PYD, a terrorist organization. PYD has been the unstoppable winner. It will gain its territorial aspirations and stretch all the way to the west. It is not logical for Turkey to carry out military operations against the PYD in Syria while ISIL has a presence. This will draw reaction from the US and even Russia. The YPG and its ally, the Syrian Democratic Forces, are partners of the U.S.-led coalition against ISIL. Turkey has harshly criticized the U.S. for accepting the groups as allies, but the Obama administration has made it clear this policy is not going to change. The YPG also enjoys good relations with Russia. It's a complicated web of alliances on the ground in Syria. Officially, the Damascus government and the YPG are not allies, but they haven't turned their guns on each other since the start of the uprising. It's not clear if there is any coordination in the offensive against the opposition in Aleppo. But what is clear is that the government and the YPG are both heading towards Aleppo's border crossing with Turkey. The border towns close to that crossing have received tens of thousands of Syrians displaced by the ongoing military operation. Turkey continues to be criticized for not allowing them to enter. Instead, it argues the refugees could safely remain in a designated zone along the Syrian side of the border. Such a safe zone would serve Turkey's national security interests by acting also as a buffer and stopping YPG's expansion and keeping the Syria regime away from its doorstep. Senator Al Jazeera, Southern Turkey.